Hey guys, beautiful day here today. I think the date today is December 28th, 2020. Last couple days of 2020 left. I hope you guys all had a good Christmas and the holidays and all that other good stuff. What I'm up to today, you say, well, today I'm out on the trap line. I got my father with me. He's just out checking with me. So, uh, man, look at that sunrise. The sun is just rising up. So, uh, we've got a pretty busy day ahead of us here. Got a lot of traps to check. Pulling up to one of my 330 Connie bears. We've got a lynx in it. See, he came down my trail. Walked in. And, oh, yeah, my bait's still in there. Let's have a look at this guy. The old 330 Duke. Oh, yeah. Nice. It's finally... Started to warm up a little bit. Uh, hopefully our 30 minus 35 uh, little spell for three weeks is over. I think it's about minus 10 out today, 15 around there. So it's, uh, it's nice to be out on the line working in this. So yeah, look at that guy here. It's, he's frozen. Still looks a little bit, a little bit brown. We'll take that chop off. We'll have a look at him. Get set up here. That's good because it's been a while since I got a lynx. So, uh, it's good to start for the morning. It's looking promising already. This was an old 330 Duke that I had dyed white. It's, uh, I, I know this trap, I got quite a few of them, but this one is, uh, well, I dyed it white. And it's caught a lot of wolverines and lynx over the years. This is one of the first ones that I set. So, uh, I know you could call it my lucky trap if you want. Anyways, yeah, look at that. Nothing shoot on him. Fur looks like it's thickening up a bit. Yeah, look at that. Some grass, nice. So, it was about... We had about 50 mile an hour winds last night and it blew all the trails in. So any tracks should be fresh today. So up ahead here, we got some 330 boxes. Uh, man, I hope there's a Wolverine in one of them. That'd be something else. So this is good. I actually thought this was a Wolverine when I first pulled up because there was Wolverine tracks. Came on the trail back there, but they're pretty blowed in. And, uh, but anyways, I'm happy with this. This is a good day. I'll throw him in my fur bag. We'll carry on. Uh, we're getting into the Martin country now, so we'll go check 65 Martin boxes today. This set here, this is the second Lynx I got in this 330 box set. Oh man, look at that sun. Oh, she's a bright one. Like yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> there, hold that there. Oh, this is looking good so far, guys. <laughs> A little smaller links than the last one. <laughs> Look at that. Headshot. Got him right behind the head. Right behind the ear. Nice. Seems how when I was packing my sleigh this morning, I said, well, I'll bring 15 120 boxes for all uh, to change out in the Martin boxes. I didn't even think of 330s. I never even crossed my mind. I was just telling Dad that they're in the last set. So these are two 330s that I gotta get replaced now. Nope. Oh, that's buried in his neck. Otherwise, I'd try and take it off, but she's frozen in there good. Your display just went off. Does that mean it's up to video? No, nope, it still goes. If you top it, it goes back off. It does that for power saving mode. Oh, okay. <laughs> so this box here. <laughs> I don't want nothing to rob my bait, so I'm just going to flip it over. And that bait's all nailed in there and hanging in there. Fish is still in there, so yeah, it'll be, it'll be good till I get back. <laughs> right on, it's a good start to the day. Good start to the day, guys. Nice looking cot. Can't wait to get these guys thawed out. Look at that. 
for example, wolf didn't eat them. <laughs> Don't say that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, there's some wolf tracks up ahead there, and and uh, well, he never came down the trail, thank goodness. But uh, yeah. So now we got these two links up ahead on that last box. I think I'll hang them in a tree there because I gotta come back this way. I'll hang them in the tree, then they're not bouncing around because we still got 30, 30, 30 kilometers to go. So you don't want to be having them bouncing around for 30 kilometers because, and I also need my bag because it's going to be filled with Martin here in a couple hours. Okay, guys, let's carry on. We're going that way. Okay, I got my links hanging right here. Hopefully nothing bothers when I'm gone. Okay guys, let's go get some Martin. This whole trap here. We've got the bait in it. Uh, weasel. Not a very big weasel. So yeah. We got about, I don't even know how many weasel I got and all. Might have got about, I don't know, seven or eight. I'll save them all and then uh Ben could skin them all later on when we got lots, you know. We're gonna have to make some stretchers for weasels, I guess. Anyways, I'll take this guy out and we'll carry on. Expect some Martin guys. Okay, that's enough weasels for today. I hope. I think I could get him out of that trap. Reset that. It's not a Martin, but they are worth money. Beats all still in there. Oh yeah, I'll get this guy out of there. We'll carry on. Next top there, there'll be a Martin in it. Look at that. Not exactly a Martin. An old squirrel. Well, you know, it'll cost more money on raid than that little squirrel pelt's worth. I think they're worth about a dollar in the fur advance but you know on the upside you could eat them if you're hungry so whatever still got the bait in there i'll change this trap out throw him in the sleigh and uh yeah we still got quite a few martin boxes to check but uh yeah well i just ran uh the martin line 65 martin boxes and not a martin, not a martin track. A couple of weasels and a squirrel. You know, I must be the worst martin trapper ever. <laughs> or there's no martin in this area. There never was a whole lot of martin around, you know, that's why I never spent a whole lot of time doing it. And I spent a month making boxes, setting traps and baiting and opening up new line. And for uh, the 10 martin I got out of here, I haven't caught no Martin in two weeks on this Martin line. So, uh, I don't know. I think I'm going to pull out of here. I think I'm going to pull all these Martin boxes down my next time through. Uh, pretty confident to say that there ain't a whole lot of Martin in the area. Uh, like how many Martin, for the amount of tracks that were here at the beginning of the year a month ago, like for the amount of tracks there was, like how many Martin made those tracks? Did those 10 Martin make all those tracks? I don't, I don't know. Maybe but uh yeah i think i'm gonna pull out of here you know i think that's the right thing to do every time i come down here it's a day so i'm wasting a day for a couple weasels yeah no this is this isn't not too good guys cute little weasel Come here, little buddy. Maybe I'll feed him some fish. I like weasels, you know. Always did. Cute little fella. Come on. Come here, little buddy. Come here, little fella. Now yeah, I'll throw him a little chunk of fish and carry on. He'll like this. Come here, little buddy. Oh, he's gone. Now I'll just leave this here for him. You'll find it. Poor little guy's got to eat too, huh? And he's back. Oh, 
it smells like fish. Oh, yeah. We'll pack the whole thing away a bit. Oh, too heavy. A little too heavy for him. Oh, you got her. Don't worry, little buddy. I won't hurt you. It's good. That'll feed him for a little while. Not a very big weasel. Okay, let's carry on. Pretty nice to be back on the eat line. It's only day two of setting across here. A few days ago, me and Dad, when we were out, we uh, broke trail a little ways. I'm only set up as far as this. I haven't gone much farther than here. Uh, the sun's setting right now, so I'm gonna do one more box set. That's one of the boxes that I made. I made the three of them. I moved them all from uh, from my west line to my east line. There seems to be a little more action around here, so I've been seeing a few few fresh sets of link tracks here, so that's all good. Uh, I just dropped a leg hold here. Number three, coyote soft catch. You know, it's uh, exactly how I always do them, so it looks pretty good. It's always been a nice little area here, a little strip of trees here, kind of open area around. Give you guys a little look of the area I'm in. Man, is it ever nice to be out back out here. Look at that. I couldn't think of anywhere else I'd rather be right now. Right here on this trail. Setting traps and talking to the camera. Anyways, guys, so... Uh, yeah, I'm gonna carry on and I'll go do this box set here. Uh, I've been making lure lately. Uh, <clears throat> I'm gonna go back when I get back here tonight. I'm gonna do a little bit more lure making in the skinning shock. And uh, I'm kinda gonna try something different, but uh, we'll get at that later. Okay guys, let's carry on. Beautiful evening, beautiful afternoon. It's not evening yet, but we'll be soon. In this bag here, I got some lures. I managed to find about a quarter bottle of hot breakers. So I'm being real stingy with it here. Like I said, that's why I'm making my own link bait here. That's fine though. You quit selling it in here, rubber. I'd have to order it. I'd have to order it from Fur Harvest. It'd take months to get in. You don't have to do that though, or make my own. Anyways, sun is just about setting. I got my one box set and I was like, I, I gotta keep going. I'm gonna go right till dark. So this set here, this is a real nice set, guys. This this set here, you just gotta throw some little bit of commercial lure on it. Uh, number three coyote soft catch. I'm kind of in the middle of an open prairie between two big heavily wooded areas. You could see the ridge there. So the lynx would always walk through here. I never ever did put a trap here. I said, today I'm gonna put one here. So anyways, there you go. So um, there's another good spot here. I'm going to uh, I'm gonna drop a couple, maybe a couple more, at least one more. It'll work till dark. I gotta get, uh, I'd like to get all my leg holds out. You know, it'd be nice to get whack about a dozen cats right off the bat, you know, right in the first couple weeks. So that'll be good. So uh, yeah, better carry on guys. Going that way into the sun. Okay, now I'm running out of daylight. It's a nice looking set here too, this one. River is just right over there. Cabin's over there somewhere. Yeah, this is a good set here, guys. I'm quite pleased with that. So they're getting put out slowly but surely. Do a few more every day. I wanted to do 10 today, but I was late getting out. I had other things to deal with. But uh, yeah, <clears throat> just do the same thing tomorrow, you know, just... Just gonna set lag holes of connie bears, big connie bears, you know. The Martin line, like I said, I'm I'm done with the Martin line for now. Ben could deal with that. Uh I probably won't even go back there this year. Maybe I'll go and pull the boxes down in a few months, but I'm done across there. I'll be working on the east line. Slaying cats. Looking right, man. That's what that's the plan. We'll call it the year of the cat. Anyways, guys, uh I'm gonna go back and cook some supper, make some bait, and uh Talk to you guys another day.